It's about attitude, Carl. The attitude in 2007, 2008 was, you know what? It serves you right. Uh, That was Treasury. And the Fed was, we're good. What's the issue? This is not the case. We've got a Federal Reserve that clearly understands what went wrong in 2009. We have a trader who is the, who is the Treasury Secretary who is saying, yeah, absolutely, we're going to be able to deal with these things. And, uh, yes, the one thing that they're not talking about is, how, is what is the ratio of people who get sick versus people who spread it. I mean, they're all trying to say, look, we're going to handle the financial side. Uh, we can't handle the virus side. That's other people. And while uh, Rick says that it's the dollar and other people saying it's commercial paper, believe me, what they're saying is we're going to hold it together financially, but you got to hope that we hold it together biologically. And that's what I think that when we get in the, in the, in the weeds is we worry about individual programs because this is not like 2007. They are listening. They are hearing what Rick is saying. They're saying, you know what, we're going to, yep. we're addressing that. Do I even ask him about hospital beds? Okay? All right, so, so to, I asked about hospital so to, fo- beds. to follow through on, on that line of thinking, Jim, if we go with Gottlieb's, it sounds like his base case, which is a peak in late April or early May, people or investors, markets are going to need to have stamina for a matter of weeks, right? Absolutely. Uh, so what you're looking for, I would say, are companies that are selling through cash, or companies that have the ability to survive no matter what because there's demand for their products. And I think that that's the way you want to analyze a stock. You want to say essential, non-essential. Essential, non-essential. And we know a lot of companies are non-essential. Uh, is, is the third-tier oil company that we all knew as being, say, a $40 stock, is it essential now at $2? No. We're going to speak to Phil LeBeau. The question is, we need an airline system. Nobody's denying that. But do we need an airline system where the companies make, make a lot of money? Well, that's not what the president's thinking about. And I think we have to think, all right, what company without help from the government will get through to the other side? And that yeah. is probably going to be a buy. You know, look, you have to just pick, you have to look at the, at the components. And there are things that I think, again, that I do want to buy. I mean, I think that Verizon is cheap. Uh, I think that I'm trying to figure out whether Verizon is 50. Eh, it's okay. It's not bad. Um, let, let's take a look at Proctor. You, 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 if you buy Proctor here, you're getting 2.74. That's not enough. I, I'm looking. I'm doing yield analysis. I'm looking for stocks that have an accidentally high yield because their their stocks have fallen, and I'm looking for stocks that are not appreciably that far from their lows within the last two years. And, 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 I think and that's that a good have thing. a reason for being in this <laughs> new world order. Yeah. And that when the smoke clears or when the illness goes away, they're, they're necessary. Uh, Darden reports this week. I mean, that's a tougher one. I mean, do we need Olive Gardens? I think we need those people to, to have jobs who work there. I think that that's a secondary. You know, your first check down, if this is going to be uh, football, your first check down is to, is to look for companies that have a lot of cash that are going to be needed after the illness is conquered. Your second one is to say, all right, what companies have good dividends that have decent cash flow that I think can get through this? And then your third one is to say, I don't want any of these companies because they could be cash strapped. And there yeah. you're thinking about some retail, retailers, restaurants, airline, travel, leisure, hotel. Those are very hard to reconcile.